Singletary, single setback, fake it. Allen looking to throw, he's got time. Uncorks, deep shot, it's caught. Right out of the gate, he hooks up with Stefan Diggs. The Buffalo Bills living up to the scouting report. That's 42 yards on the first play from scrimmage. Stutter and go. And watch where Ahmad Gardner right there just essentially stopped his feet. And once he did that, Diggs had a two-way go. Do I go inside? Do I go outside? Either way, I know my quarterback will find me. Gabe Davis leading the NFL in yards per catch. Fake and throw. That laser beam. Good for a first down. It's hauled in at the 45-yard line as he hummed it in there to Diggs for 13. Damn, that'll spread it here. Five receiver look. Allen. Protection holds up initially. Throwing on the move. And Davis, the intended receiver, it's incomplete. Allen pressure from Franklin Myers. And there was a little bit of an on dig so far. Yeah, the Buffalo Bills, they want their stars to be stars and even bigger stars. Put him on the move. It's first play of the game. Get him in motion, double move, big. Allen, complete to Diggs. First down. This is the number one scoring offense or should say number two at 29 points per game that's good for seven yards dj reed in coverage against Diggs, and you know it's coming but the way that stefan Diggs runs routes the setups the movements he still gets to the spot he wants to go similar to michael thomas in his prime for the new orleans saints look at the communication all up and down the line to make sure everyone is in sync from the 21, Allen, pump, floats, caught by Diggs. That's not designed. That's Allen and Diggs just being on the same page. You nailed that one, absolutely, and understanding my quarterback's in trouble. It's not predetermined, but you have to know where to go to get in the sight. Okay, here you go. I found an open spot. Come find me. And he Second and six. Allen pats the ball and throws to Diggs on time. And Diggs got Reed in the blender. 17 yards, catch and run. We talked about timing at the top of the show. He's going to go and make the throw before Stephon Diggs comes totally out of his break because the timing is so exquisite. And then he breaks a tackle to gain the extra yard. It's a loss of seven for Buffalo. Second and 17. Allen has time. Intercepted. Sauce Gardner's got it. And the Jets are in business inside the Buffalo 20. What a read by Sauce Gardner because he was playing too deep zone. And when that means the corners are rolled up, Gardner sees the play and falls back into coverage into the passing lane and gets a big time interception for the Jets. They are here for the Bills. Shotgun. Allen steps up, fires, deep ball. Knocked away. The recovery by Reed against Stefan Diggs. This has come through once again. Reed with the catch-up speed ball, just a tad short, which allows Reed to make a play on it. And the ball arrives, has his head around, and makes a play on the stay of the ready. Almost hockey line shifts, get him out there and rush him. And you're talking about an elite NFL quarterback who relishes these moments. First down for Buffalo. Allen, step, throw, on the sideline. Stefan Diggs brings it in. Flag thrown. Back at the 15-yard line. Corner in the safety, and they put it in there perfectly. Holding. Offense, number 73. Coming back. 10-yard penalty. The play, first down. Catch. We're both feet down anyway. It's a moot point. Yeah. Third and 21. Allen. Low throw is incomplete. Or else. Fourth and 21. Allen running around. Jets try to stick with him. Allen tosses. Deep ball on the way. In 
incomplete. Gabe Davis, the intended target, and the Jets will win it. A shocking victory. Sauce Gardner doing snow angels as he continues to make a name for himself in the NFL. 20 to 17. And you're hoping Gabe Davis can use his body to make a play. He even pushes off on the inside. But with the length of Sauce Gardner, nearly 6'4", he's right there and doesn't make it easy and also is not able to be pushed away. He stayed attached, or what they call plastered to the receiver, and makes the biggest play of the afternoon. Everybody was asking, are the Jets for real? Five and three after eight games. The second half last week against New England, it felt like a step back. Today, a matchup against the best the NFL has to offer. The Buffalo Bills, six and one, riding a four-game winning streak. And it's the Jets who come out with a huge divisional win. They knock off the Bills 20 to 17 to improve to six and three.